My best friend Paul Pfeiffer was off to prep school, which left me. completely on my own. Yeah, this wasn't going to be bad at all. Kevin Arnold? Stuart Carpazian! Remember me? We both had Miss Rita for fourth grade. Oh, hi, Stuart. Wow, it's good to see you. You're probably wondering what happened to me. See, my dad got a job in Tucson when I was in fifth grade, so we moved. But I'm back now. Jujubi? No, thanks. So, how's your mom? Hey, remember when she chaperoned our field trip to the zoo? And the elephants are doing it? You almost Jeez, was this kid blind? Couldn't he see what was happening here? Remember that time you came down with the Hong Kong flu? Here she came. It was right after lunch. Fish, sticks, and peas, and you threw up all over your desk. Stuart! Well, I gotta go to class now. It's been nice talking to you. See you later. With any luck, Stuart Carpazian would be lost in the system. Hey, would you look at this? Talk about luck. Hey, you know what I was thinking about? That time we were playing basketball and you ran into the pole and knocked a hole in your head? Stuart, class is going to start, OK? We'll talk later. Oh, yeah, sure, sure. Carpazan. Uh, that's Carpazian, sir. What did you say? Finally, something familiar. Lunch. Winnie, an oasis in a sea of strangers. She looked so alone, I thought I'd go over and do the best I could to console her. Hi, Winnie. Mind if we sit with you? Come on, Kevin, you can squeeze in. I could manage on my own. Plenty of folks I could sit with. Good folks, honest folks. Folks like, say, mm. Hey, Kev. Pretty neat cafeteria, huh? Stuart. Remember that time you got that pencil stuck up in your nose? Huh? I always had Stuart. Huh? Kevin, wait up. Oh, hi, Winnie. Where have you been? No round. I'm sorry about lunch the other day. That's OK. No problem. Are you all right? Yeah. I'm going this way, so I'll see you later, OK? OK. Oh, Kevy. Absolute fear. You get the boosh. Hey! I want to know if you're going to the football game tonight. You know, afterwards, I hear they're going to toilet paper Cheryl Manning's house. Go away, Stuart. You remember her. You hit her in the head with the tetherball once. Go away. Gee, Kev, your hair's all wet. You know, speaking to you as a friend, you Look, should really... Stuart, don't you get it? We're not friends. Just because you sat behind me in the fourth grade doesn't mean we're friends. We weren't even friends then. So why don't you get someone else to hang around with, OK? Because I can't take it anymore. You hear me? 